Welcome back to Kerbal Hard and Uncut, you find us. Yeah, I'm keeping it on this screen for a little bit because we have still got a lot of orbital velocity. We're actually quite low. Um, we, we could still go wrong. Let's uh, let's continue. Oh, I still have to land this thing. What are we coming up to, actually? Where, where are we? Um, we're nowhere. What's that? The Woomerang. I've never used the Woomerang launch site. I do like this. I must visit this more. So there's that desert airfield again. Oh, we're going to land. Uh, we're going to land in the sea. That's nice. Okay, that's good. Right. So yeah, we've uh, last episode we landed upon the moon using uh, the jank craft, as we should call it, moon three. The jank craft. I like the way this discolors a bit. Actually, I think the time they took into the effort they put into actually change that so it gets darker as you use up more and more of the the stuff. I, th I really I really appreciate things like that. Um, it would be cool if like the side of the pods got it, but I think that's maybe asking too much uh, for this, uh, of course. <sighs> Considering what the water looks like on this game, um, you know, I'm, I'm not saying anything. It just it would be nicer if it was potentially. I, I one of the things I do miss, yeah, yeah, e Eve or whatever you want to call, you know, scatter all those things are are wonderful for this. When does this parachute supposed to fire? Oh, a thousand. Okay. Oof getting a little bit worried then actually I thought we we're gonna have a problem thank you very much Oof. doesn't daft take a while to open up doesn't it my lord if you're coming down at an angle you are in a problem now you did not walk on the moon so it's gonna be interesting to see what what stars what points you get we can accelerate this through now um so you've orbited around Kerbin. and you've orbited around the moon that was a couple of times so you uh this craft has been to the surface of the moon so that should get us something for it a bit of science that would be nice um so there we go right splashy downy do you want to do an eva i don't think you need to do you yeah let's just recover the vessel right let bets on how much science we got i don't think we've got much i think this is going to be one of the lowest moon landing science missions ever because we don't have eva um, i could have got the astronaut complex before we went i know i could have done that um, I have not because, yeah. Okay, so. Mystery Goo got us 24. Did it? I didn't realise it got us that much. Munz Highlands. Okay. Crew report from Munz Highlands. Oh, so we landed in Highlands. That's quite interesting. I don't know if I often land there. Um, I'll it'll probably turn out I always land there. Um, space near the moon. Recover vessel from the surface of the moon got us 18. That's all. Really? So, like, the Apollo. In fact, I suppose Apollo never landed on the moon and was recovered. So this, yeah. I don't know. Um, we got... Oh, we got a lot of funds. That's good. So we've got some we've got some stuff back. Let's see what contracts we've got. So world's first. Recently accomplished this. You have returned uh, home from the surface of the moon. Okay, so we've got like 20. That's not much, is it? For that. Uh, science data from the surface of the moon, 36. Wonderful. And science data from space around the moon. Another chunk of that, right? Well, first of all, we're going to get... Ooh, but I could... Ooh, no, we're getting maneuver nodes. We're just not having a debate about that. Right. How much are these now? Oh, we could actually afford a new pilot. Is there anybody that's really good? Like, mask, perfect courage, no stupidity. You, you Tamlas. No, sorry, not not good enough. What have we got mission-wise? So, hi, Gene, how are you doing? Yeah, do you see what we did? Yeah, it was good, wasn't it? Um, what is it with all of these things? Anti-engine... Tourist, 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 blah, 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 blah. Don't want tourists. Right. So we need to get this, and we also need to uh, rendezvous two vessels. Park two vessels next to each other around Kerbin. Okay. Let's see what science we've got. Science. Um, I can get some science. So we could get, we could finally get solar panels. I could finally have a solar, but there is other things. What else is there? I could do now. There's no point getting re EVA repair kits because we can't EVA. Um, what about up here? We could we could get other stuff and things. Um, right. So I think our our next our next goal. Yeah, I think we go off solar panels. It, it's it's a no brainer really. Um, our next goal is going to be, I think, the astronaut complex. Although this thing potentially would be better because 255 parts and basic action groups basically makes everything better doesn't it um let us see let's can let, let, let's continue um i would like eva because it's going to give us a chunk of science and we need science 
but equally funds is important and unless i can build bigger craft you know being limited to 30 parts in the curbing system is killing us at the moment so thank you so i think we need to do that and that right now okay that's what we're going to do um so the question is do we do we send a few craft up do we send one craft up what's we gonna i have a horrible feeling that um i think they both need to be to, what does it say does it say actually um the the scientists in Kerbin, our exploration of Kerbin is going on by we must continue this we need to test around if we can pack two vessels next to each other around Kerbin. what could possibly go wrong we must continue to unravel the mystery of this no 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 basically it doesn't say anywhere that it needs two people so i don't have to send another person up but i'm going to because i can so um yeah let's 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 get a craft built something nice and easy to put a craft up first of all we don't need month three you know what? we could actually just modify this thinking about it um yeah let's take this and modify it i'm going to we'll keep that bit as it is um we'll take these off i want to make it cheap don't i um i want to take this off we're going to make this top bit a little bit smaller more, more agile that's what we want just a little one of these and we'll go for that put that on there that's more agile okay and then put this on there there we go um What's the delta v? So that's going to give me it's going to give me a vast amount of delta v, isn't it? So that's that's enough to do anything in orbit, basically. Um, yeah, it is. And there's no real point having SAS on because it doesn't work. So I'm going to have to use the gimbal on there anyway for absolutely everything. Um, hmm. Yeah. Right. So we have got that. Do that. Uh, that's going to be an awful lot, isn't it? The only problem is that doesn't actually give me much through. Oh no, it does, because I've lightened that now. So I wonder if I could just take these off. What does that do for me? What's sea level? It's one night. So that's 2,000, so it's 4,000. I think that's enough. Uh, I think that is enough to get us going. But let's have a look. Uh, that's 1.5. We could put a couple of little solids on the side, just uh stick a few solids on the side that would probably be a nice little little launch vehicle get them on um i don't know how many we want just two two be nice a couple of solids stick them on that bit of hammers yeah the hammer no yeah, mm. yeah hammers hammers would be nice they just give us a little push what's that that's a good idea actually get you onto there wonderful thank you very much that's two eight and a yeah that's uh, that's good and we could just do that and put that onto there and then we'll just uh, pull you down a little bit you might actually give us you might actually give us a little bit of uh, dynamic stability actually thinking about it because um we would be looking to having there's not enough dynamic ability and i've got um do i have a probe actually thinking about it? i now have oh do you have ses you do well, that's a problem solved, then, isn't it? Uh, yep, no, get off. That is a problem solved. We're, gonna, we're having you. Thank you very much. Stick you there. Put that there. Um, you, you think that actually this may be cheat? It's not. Our, our Kerbals don't need space. They, they do not need space to breathe because they are our plants, obviously. That's why they're doing that. Right. There we go, get that up. That's that's the least aerodynamic thing I've ever seen in my entire life. That is horrible. That is actually horrible. Anyway, um, actually, he could just do a crew report, can't he? He doesn't need to do goo canisters. What am I talking about? There we go. Fix that. That looks terrestrial. That's terrible. Right. Um, so that's given me some stability assistance. Uh, it's probably added some mass and so forth to the system, though. So let's just uh, do this. Is this going to fix it? Yeah. Okie doke. So we need to put some nose cones on the top. Thank you very much. There we go. Do that. They are wonderful. Um, actually, we're going to use them as we're going to we're going to use them as feet because we do not have the feet at the moment. We don't. I don't believe we have got. No, we don't. We still don't. Okay. Right. So this is. Uh, 
I don't know, uh, run about, about one. Okay, we've got five minutes. So we're gonna launch this one uh, and put it into an orbit. We're not sending you, Berlin, no, we're not sending you. Uh, we're gonna send uh, you, yeah, that's right. You get ready for it, run about one. Save that, launch it please, I think is what I wanna do. Nope, you need to come down here. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. So that's eight. So five, five, five. Oh yeah, there's loads there. If even if that's in uh, in space settings, right? Let's uh, launch it. Right, I've got four and a half minutes to get this into orbit. Four and a half minutes to get this into orbit. Then the next episode, we can try and rendezvous using maneuver nodes. How exciting! Oh yes, it's amazing. Oh, this actually means I'll be able to see time to. Yeah, I do. I can see time to. Oh, this is. Oh, it's like a dream come true. Oh, it's so wonderful. There we go. Good. Go on. Off we go. Launch your poos. Knock our thrust down to just a little bit. So there we go. We can start to just uh, turn over just a smidgen. There we are. Look at that beautiful solid fuel firing away, getting us into the atmosphere. We're going, going quite fast, but we don't really matter, to be honest with you. Um, we have got a roll on, interestingly. Now, why do I have a roll? Why is there a roll? That is interesting. Ah. Ooh, come back. Come back. That's interesting. Why has it got a roll? Why has it got this odd little roll going on? Interesting. Now, obviously, this is a, the first type of probe you can get, so I hope they didn't. I think they just... I think they just hit each other and then there's bits falling down. I hope they don't hit anything because we do have destructible facilities on, so that would be that would be brilliant, you know. Congratulations, you've built your um you, you've you've built your tracking station. Unfortunately you've just hit it with rubble and it's all exploded now. Um oh actually. There we go. That might explain why we're not going up at a speed I was expecting. Alright. Okay, so our thruster weight is now up in the sensible range. We that Note to self, actually make sure you've got your thrust on full. That's interesting. All right, we're going to tap this up a bit and get going. So I would like to know where that rotation came from, though. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to send this up, and I'm going to monitor pretty much how it goes up, um, see how much delta V it's got when it's up there, because the amount of delta V it has will determine whether I, I send a, just a copy of this up or whether we actually send a... Ooh, it would actually help if I pointed the craft upwards. would probably be a good idea, wouldn't it? That's probably a better idea to go like that. Uh, we'll just get this up to like 80 and then we'll just zero out the, t the time on it. There we go. Just let it do its stuff. Right. Uh, let's check this electric charge. That was me being silly. I was turning over too quickly because you see there, now we're going up. Um, that's all right. We're getting into 80 kilometer orbit. It's fine. Oh, oh, I know what I can do. I know what I can do. I can use a maneuver node. <laughs> right. Uh, not a good idea to do it while you're in, in the atmosphere, but yeah, whatever. You can see, are we, are we now over? Are we over? We're about to leave the atmosphere, so it's almost fine. So add maneuver. Oh god, this is this is a dream, isn't it? Look at this, being able to being able to create maneuver nodes and everything. Oh yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I've got about a minute and a, a minute and a half to go of this episode. Eighty-three by eighty. Oh, oh, that's just it's You don't you don't understand how much you you miss it, do you? So we're going to get most of this uh, pop into orbit from this. Um, we could actually send an engineer to the moon now with this because we have a probe that will allow me to stabilize the craft. That's just ter terrible, isn't it, right? Um, and it even tells us, oh, we even get our burn times and everything. Oh, this is just, yeah, this this I should have got straight away. I shouldn't have got, um, what did I get? I shouldn't have got the mission control. Oh, no, you have to get that anyway. You have to get that anyway, but um, yeah, I think... Getting maneuver nodes, you know, I don't have the parts, but I now have the maneuver nodes, so I'm, 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 I, I'm, I'm happier. I'm, I'm very happy actually right now. So this thing, tiny compared to the thing that we actually sent to the moon, but it's got a big punch. You know, you got you got half as much fuel on board, but you know, two thirds, two thirds the delta V because you know, as you put more fuel on, it becomes less and less effective. So there we go. We're going to get ourselves into the orbit. Just do that a bit actually. We need to be careful that we're not using electrical because, of course, we are going to have electric uh, vanishing. And there we go. We're going to pop ourselves into orbit. Bow. Now, there we go. We are in an orbit. We can fix that next time. So there we are. How wonderful. Turn off that. And we are just going to sit there. Now, 
our electric will run down. So I'm gonna to have to come off here and prepare our next craft. But what we can do is we can just run a crew report while I'm here, keep that experiment because that, when he goes back down, will complete the um, science data from around Kerbin. And that is the end of this episode. So from me, until next time, have a great one.